guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I do have a Dollar Tree haul. It's uh, not very big, but I did find some pretty awesome and new things that I wanted to share with you guys. So if you guys are not subscribed, consider subscribing. Click that little notification bell so you guys will be notified of all my future uploads. And let's just jump right into it. I won't take much of your time. There's just a little bit here, but I was really excited to find the first item. This is the Hard Candy 12 Hour Protection Setting Spray. So a lot of you guys have found this. I'm so excited that I did find it. Hard Candy, I mean, it's great. This says anti-pollution. You guys like it. I know some of you guys have found it. You guys let me know, did you guys really love it? How did it perform? Do you really feel like it you feel like it really worked great. Um, Anti-blue light, anti-pollution. I mean, wow, it's kind of, it's kind of pretty awesome. And I mean, this is why I love the Dollar Tree because when we can get brand name things like these, I just, it just makes me so happy. So I picked up a few of these, but yeah, let me know if you guys like it. I'd love your guys' feedback and opinion on that. And then the next thing I did find was the hand, uh, hand, <laughs> Hard Candy, this is the Sensitive Skin Primer. So I have never even seen this. I think some of you guys, let me know too, do you guys love it? Do you guys have sensitive skin and did it work for you? Dermatologist tested, oil free, silicone free. I think that is really nice. Honestly, I don't think I've ever seen a sensitive skin primer. I could be totally wrong, but that is really, really nice. I mean, that was awesome. So I was really excited to find that. And then the next things that I did come across, okay, I found, everything's always right behind me. I found some awesome socks, okay? And these are like name brand and I, I just, oh, my, my daughter was just so excited. She was so excited about this. So if you guys are Star Trek fans, check this out. They have Star Trek socks. I couldn't believe it. So these are the, they're a men's sock size 10 to 13 and they are crew socks. And I found this guy. How cool is this? I see this is another thing. I just get so excited about all this good stuff. And then we have this one right here. And then the back on like the foot, it says Star Trek as well as the other ones say like Star Trek on the back. So there's four in all that I found. I don't know if there's any more, but I, my daughter was just so excited, <laughs> so excited. And then uh, we have this one and then it's black with the Star Trek writing on the back. And then I am dropping everything today. And then the next one is the yellow, this guy, and then it has Star Trek. So if you guys are Star Trek fans, be on the lookout because they have new socks. I hope, I just love, I like them coming out with just, or not coming out, but getting in just good name brand stuff because stuff like this, I mean, it's way more than just a dollar. So when you can find it, actually, it says distributed by Green Briar. So that's interesting. How? Well, that's kind of cool. I'm kind of excited about that. I just, socks make me happy. And then I did find two new women's socks that were kind of neat. They had so many to pick from, but I only picked up two. And this is the women's socks that fit size five to nine. But look how cute this one. It's a little unicorn. And then I'm obsessed with the, the little socks that have the fuzzies right there. So I thought that one was kind of neat. And then the other one that I did pick up is the little polar bear. And it's got the little fuzzy, like, little ears right here up on top. And that's what that one looks like. But you guys, they had so many. I think they had, like, a big, like, a mouse with really big ears. They had quite a bit to pick from. So if you guys are needing socks, it's kind of nice that uh, the Dollar Tree is getting a lot in as of late, which is great because, you know how socks are. They just... We lose them and uh, you just, 
never can, I think, never can have enough socks. So I did find a few things for, I think, Easter baskets. I think this would be so awesome. So this isn't really in the Easter section, but they always have had the Crayola bathtub finger paint all the time, but I've never seen the pastel colors before. So they had tons of pastel colors. Usually it's just like the bright reds and yellows and blues, but I just, these are really pretty. So we have the pink and the blue. This is bubblegum and sky blue. And this is what this looks like. So I just think these would be so cute to put in an Easter basket because everything in Easter is like kind of pastel and cute. So I did pick these up. My daughter loves these. Now these are like a mess and you have to clean up after they bathe. But my I haven't bought this type of stuff in for a long time and my seven year old was kind of requesting some type of this stuff for her, you know, for for her Easter and I thought this was perfect, a dollar each. These are for three ages, three and up and like I said, it's kind of nice that they had all like pastel colors. And then going along with this, they always have these at the Dollar Tree, but they brought back a whole bunch more. So this is the Bath Fizzies. This is the Shimmer and Shine, and this is just the water coloring tablets. My daughter loves these, and so I thought this would just, I'm kind of thinking ahead of, because that's kind of our next holiday is Easter, and I thought these would be really great for for her Easter basket. So I just decided to pick up those. And then the next thing I thought would be great for her Easter basket, look how cute. I don't know if I've ever seen this at the Dollar Tree, but it's a unicorn and she is so stinking cute, but she's a piggy bank. So I thought that was so great. Here's like the little thing. It goes, you know, all the money can be right there. I just thought this would be cute and might be really cute for the Easter basket as well. So I just picked that up. I thought she was just adorable. So stinking cute. And then you guys, the last thing that I grabbed, if your kids love like Barbie and stuff, they have some new, not I guess not name brand Barbie stuff, but they have career outfits for your dolls. And they had so many to pick from. So this is for ages three and up and it says it fits most 11.5 um, inch dolls. So your typical kind of Barbie doll. But I did get her the like um, the vet. So she's got her little vet outfit and then a little dog right there and some little shoes, but they had like, oh my goodness, so many to pick from. So yeah, they have like, there's all the ones in the back that you can kind of pick from. So those are new and uh, I thought that was kind of awesome. So I just went ahead and picked that up and you guys, that was it for my Dollar Tree haul. I know it's super, super fast. My Dollar Tree is Last week it was doing good. This week it's kind of slow. I think they're kind of transitioning. They're really starting to clean and um, I don't know. And then I guess I heard that we're getting a new Dollar Tree close to me as well. It's supposed to be really big and I cannot wait. I guess it opens up in March and uh, oh my gosh, I cannot wait to go into that Dollar Tree. So I'm just tickled pink about that. So uh yeah, I'll be, maybe I'll film it. Maybe I'll, I, I'll film it. I know the manager that's kind of flipping on over there and uh, maybe I can, can film it for you guys. That would be really awesome if I can get permission for that because I think that would, oh, nothing like a new Dollar Tree, you know? So, well, that was it you guys for my video today. I hope everybody has a wonderful day and, uh, let me know about the setting sprays and the um, primer if you guys liked it and stuff. I'd love to hear your guys' feedback on these too. And other than that, you guys, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.